Alright. Hey guys, it's me again. Um, I thought this time I'd uh, try an Amnesia custom story called uh, Cannibalism. I know uh, I that particular one stood out to me because that's uh, one of my biggest fears is being cannibalized. So. Yeah, now you know. I'm gonna start it now. Oh, crap. I have not surely forgotten it all. I still remember a lot of things about my childhood, about my life. There are just some things that I cannot recall as if they were covered behind the shadows. Cool. I guess I'll read this one too. Well, someone is apparently eating very loudly. I have not forgotten it all. Still remember parts of it. I am not sure about my name or why I'm here in this mansion, or why I'm covered in dust and cold sweat. However, I do remember that this... Ah, oh, fuck. I didn't read it fast enough. No great genius has ever existed without some touch of madness. Aristotle. Oh, is that an ear? Shit, I was in the... Did I just come out of the chimney? Oh, no tinder boxes. Alright. Nope. Herbert Longford's diary number one. My cousin William has arrived today. He visits very... Uh, his visit was very unexpected, but I have always liked William. As we were boys, we, were, we always talked to one another while the others were playing. Of course, he was very tired of the trip and we got no chance to talk today. He ate and went to bed. Tomorrow we'll have a grand conversation. Alright. Open. Ooh. Okay, books I can't grab. Empty. Can I open this top one right there? No. That one is empty too. And empty. Oh wait, no. What is this? Apparently I can't grab it. Wait. I have a knife. That work. Okay. Now I can't pick that up either. Let's see what's in here. Wait a minute. Crouch. Yeah. Right, Tinder box. All right, nothing. Fuck in here. Who said that? Oh, crap, random spot of blood. Oh, man. Alright. How about you? You want to open? Oh, you do. Alright. What is this? Oil. Oil from my what? Tinder box. Another tinder box. What's this? Room key of cook. <laughs> it's my plate mouse. It's a dead mouse. Oh, ow. Okay. Oh shit. 
creepily green in this room. Yeah, sure, why not? Moldy bread. Gonna bake it. Boxes. No hammer. Hell yeah. I'm gonna open it with this. Uh, pick it up. Fuck. Uh. Open the door. Uh, fuck it. I'm just gonna try that key, I guess. Sweet. Oh, fuck. We're just pants. Nope. Nothing in there. Ooh, what's that? Ugh. Sure, why not? So I can read my note. Cook's note, number one. Today I gave a vaccine to all dogs, and now the master's best one is missing. Of course the master suspects me, but I am not to blame, even though I have stolen a spare key to his room. Oh, you dirty son of a bitch. I wonder why he doesn't trust you. <laughs> Stupid naked dead body. What the fuck? Gave me goosebumps. That opens. Hello? Okay. Dinner box. Open door. Okay, I guess I can only get a tinderbox in here. Whoop, whoop. Another one. Get some light up in this bitch. Is this your room, bro? Nope. What? Someone sweeping? Nope. Alright, let's try that. Is this your room? Yes, it is. What the? Yeah. Drop that. I can pick it up. Ooh, gross. Ooh, a lantern. Yeah, I like the camera. Read this note. Herbert Longford's diary number two. When I woke up, my oldest servant, Bob, told me about two very odd things. First, during the night, someone stole a notable amount of meat from my cellar. Secondly, one of my hunting dogs got missing. That doesn't seem right, but okay. The first case is odd enough, but the second is very unsettling. First, I suspected my new cook, at least about the first case, but when we searched the kitchen and his room, we found nothing. He could not have eaten it all during the night either. I have promised a reward for anyone who finds the one responsible for this crime. I did not have a chance to talk with William today either, because I was strolling in the forest looking for my dog, T. 
until the late night. Alright. Case of staircase. Alright, I think I'm gonna call the night here. Alright, guys. Good night, and uh, I shall continue this another time.